Part four on the Civic Build coming at ya. Bought a set of fuel lines off the Facebook Marketplace to the hybrid rail I got. Technotic showed it. Let's go to this old school. That was in the car when I bought it. It's an old school fuel pressure regulator. Set that up. Put a new gauge on it because the one on it was smashed to death. I put this Jimmy Rig clutch set up on it. And then I'm just going to jack it up. Uh, change the oil in it. And then... I'm gonna go for a fire up check for leaks and shit, but Nathan's on his way here, so I'm not gonna touch the car until Nathan gets here because Nathan helped me out big time with this with this car. So Nathan's on his way here. Change the oil guys. K20 go fire up. Alright. Go for the first fire up. Could be fuel leaks everywhere. Check for leaks and hit the button up front and top. Can't look at the camera and look at the fucking leaks. Oh the keys ain't in here. What? What? Oh my For god. Sakes. You wrote the clip. Got the keys. Gotta show you what just happened to the rear bumper though. Oh, I opened the garage door and the car must have rolled back. And there's a little clip on the garage door. You see oh. that little, that thing? Just went straight up the back of the car. Brutal. Absolutely fucking brutal. So, yeah, that's what it is. I mean, I'm not, I'm not shook over. I really don't care. But... Nathan took it to her because he really loves the EG. Yeah, well, see me on car. All right, check for fuel leaks. Yep. You ready? Yep. Oh, I can't see it. Fuel leaks? Not focusing, but no, there's no, no fuel leaks. You got 40 psi or so. You ready? Yep. Oh, you got the throttle set up? Well, she's turning over good. Is that battery charged? Not really. Come on! Uh, well, she sounds good. She's turning over healthy. Probably got to get the computer out. Alright, we got the laptop in there for the saucy two and iron. Let's go for fire up. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? Yeah, give her. Oh. Hold on. It's throwing a call here, multiplexer. I don't see it. multiplexer. Multiplexer, normal. Disabled. Alright. Is the box checked or not checked? I disabled it. Okay. Alright, were you recording? Yep. Round two. Round two. No fuel leaks, eh? Well, that little bit on the fuel rail, but you'll have to just tough on that later. Yeah, she got pressure. You ready? Yeah. Alright, you good? Didn't have the clutch in, did you? No. <laughs> Fucking Jesus. All right, gonna have to go for round three here. Yeah. All right. Round three. Round three. <laughs> Third time to chair. <laughs> it's about time this car got a game. <laughs> Alright boys, K20 EG fired up. We still got a list here I gotta do, somewhat. I gotta get the rat eater done, uh, exhaust, just open header, I'll probably leave that, street drive it. I need diff fluid, I need trans fluid, big time. And driver side, DJ! Ball joints hanging out of her. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna do those couple things. I don't know, I might fab up the exhaust, I need a three ball flange and cannot find one. But she's fired up, let's fucking go. Let's go rip this son of a gun. Ready to rip. Almost. Pretty much. She will be. Get that out of my face. This is what we were working with for an exhaust. With the Canadian tire. This is a three ball flange, two piece. 
Disgusting. It is not what we need, but I can't find a three ball, two and a half inch exhaust anywhere, so this is it. Um, the gasket lines up pretty good, actually. Like it's, uh, I'll get on there. As you can see, the gasket's bang on, so it should work. I'm gonna go bolt this up to the car, tighten that all up, and then get some pipe off and weld something to it. I got the rad in, as you guys see. I actually have the heater core set up. So I'm hoping this has heat. I never fired it up and bled the system or nothing yet. Just slowly working on this list here. Still got to do that driver's eye BJ. But yeah, exhaust. I'm going to work on the exhaust now. Rad's pretty much done. Fucks get that air. So yeah, exhaust, diff fluid, and driver's side ball joint. And then this thing's... I'm fucking taking this thing to work. Like, this is going to be my daily right now. So let's start fucking with this exhaust. So I went into the car. Bolt that up, tack this piece of pipe to it, and we're going to weld this out solid. That there is pretty close to my stock exhaust on the car. It's like a quarter inch away. I'm hoping I can move some hangers, pull that tighter. But yeah, let's weld this up, and then uh, we'll bolt this to the car so it's not open header. Alright, boys, exhaust is done. Just adding some manual transmission fluid in the nail. I got the ball joint done, and uh, we're going to back this out start bleeding the cooling system. So we can take this for a rip. First, I got to put this fucking train fluid in, so let's get it outside. Well, let you see the exhaust in a second. Hopefully, it's not leaking. Couldn't really reach the top, and uh, yeah, let's pour this in. Oh yeah, that's the good stuff there. Probably should have cleaned this funnel first, but I didn't. I think it takes two quarts. I'm gonna fire in two quarts. Go for the best. All right, guys, got an intake on. Maybe touching the coolant hose. I could probably spin that down. Anyways, I'm going to fire it up. So, uh, let's hear this exhaust. Get the battery strap. Battery strap. Get the battery strap on here. You don't want to go too tight, right? You want it quick release. I always have it on quick release. Grab the keys. Fire it up. Let's hear this exhaust. See how it sounds. I have no idea what's on this for a muffler, so this could sound whack, could sound good. Interesting. Um, something must be hitting throttle cable. Throttle cable was janked that way. <laughs> it might not rev its face off now. Ugh. Round two. Alright guys. Oh yeah. She is outside boys. Let's go. Still needs a clutch bled. It's really bad. We must not have bled in here enough or there must have been air in the system. I took it out here. The thing was like with the clutch on it was almost pulling through the clutch. So have to do that with someone but look at this. Outside case swapped. Sick. Alright guys we're in the Civic. We're going to go for a test rip. I uh, put a different tune on it than the tune that was on the K-Pro because it was definitely off. That just made a weird sound. We're kind of low on fuel too. We're probably going to need gas. Take this to the garage, get some fuel, go do some pulls for you. See how she sounds. Still a little loud. As you guys hear, it's a little loud in the car. I, I didn't weld the top of the pipe right there, so the exhaust is going to shoot up right here. going pretty good um, the transmissions very iffy it already pops at a second on me so I'm thinking that the shift linkage the, the cables might have to be adjusted maybe I don't know I gotta look more into that but it's running good it's uh I wouldn't know if it's overheating or not because I don't get the heat gauge set up so uh, that's a that's a bonus and uh, yeah I don't know heat's working stereo works so she's doing pretty good boys
guys open, like, and subscribe.